What's up guys, it is Passive here, back with another video, and this is going to be a tutorial on how to use Passive Bot Partner Program, and what this does is it basically allows you to share your Discord server with other servers. Um, so what you can do is set your own message, and basically it'll be sent to another server every 30 minutes, and yeah, that's pretty much the basis of it. Um, you can also track the stats on how many servers it's reached, how many users it's reached, and also do a lot of different customization things, such as setting the color, um, setting a link and description, uh, having an optional thumbnail image, uh, showing your user count, for example, there, uh, showing an image, if we can find one that's using it, um, and there's a bunch of other different ones as well. Um, so yeah, if we go into here, what you first need to do is basically invite the bot. So I'll have a link in the description to that, or what you can do is join a server that has the bot and just type .p invite, and it'll give you an invite link. You can invite that to your server, and then from there, what you'll need to do is go .p help partner, and this will give you a, a message that will uh, show you all the different uh, commands for it. So from there, um, what you can do is go .p partner info, and it'll basically show you all the stuff you've done. So, so far mine's reached uh, 1,800 servers, 171,000 members or users. Um, and yeah, so what you want to do first is just ensure that it is enabled. So if your setting says enabled equals false, what you'll want to do is go .p partner toggle and it'll basically toggle that on so we can do that just do that now what you'll want to do is set your partner channel so mine was already set to partners but i can do that again so if we go to e partner set channel it'll set that so um that just means uh, messages from other servers will be sent to your server then um, you can also do partner message, so set up the message. So for example, if we go .p partner message join nation Discord bots development server. Let's just do it. And then you'll need to include an invite link. So if we just go instant invite, edit invite link, make sure it's set to expire after never and no limit for max number of uses. Then hit generate a new link and then click copy and put that in your message as well. Um, so basically then it will set up your server and allow you to use the other settings. So what we can do now is set an RGB color, basically. Um, so if we go .b partner color, and then if we look up some nice hex colors real quick, hex colors, and go ahead and just go to one of these, for example. And I like the look of maybe this purple one here. And it'll just give me that. And what I can do with that is go back in here and set that. It does uh, require it to be a hex color that you submit. And see, you can see that it's now set like that. Um, other settings are your user count. So if we go to .p partner user count, we can toggle that off and on. So that'll just basically show people how many users are in the uh, current server. Um, next, there's image URL, so you can set an optional image. So if we just go down here, for example, Discord, go to images, there, right click, copy image address. Hopefully that doesn't copy the huge long one, but if we go, dot p partner image url and paste that in there you can see that it'll set our image url to that 
Um, next, you can also show your server thumbnail. So for example, just maximize that properly. Uh, so for example, we've got the passive nation uh, image there. And if we go ahead and go dot p partner, what is it called again? Just thumbnail. It'll toggle that on and it'll show that. And then that's basically all of the commands there. Um, so if you do need help with this, I'll also have a link to the support server down in the, in the description. And yeah, um, your message will be sent to a different server every 30 minutes. Um, so you will end up reaching a lot of members fairly quickly. Like in a day, that's 48 different servers that you'll reach basically. Um, and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial and peace out.